Okay, so today we're gonna do some hands control. We're gonna do some hands control neck control. So you guys gonna learn how to break your partner's balance. Okay, first thing, you never wanna look down. You don't wanna keep his head down. First time that he puts his head, his head down. First chance that I have, I will lock my video. So you never wanna your head down. You wanna your hip down. Your hip gotta be low. Never your head. You wanna change the level. What's gonna change is your hip. Here. Not your head. Put your head down. You need to take down. We're gonna, your, your opponent's gonna start to scramble. So what are we gonna do here? I'll keep your shoulders, hands up, wrist control, neck control. Now let's say he's holding my neck. So I always want my arm over his arm here. Okay, so I can tap. If I wanna avoid takedowns, you put your arms in. So we're gonna be here fight. Look, I'm pulling his head down. You're gonna bust it up. So that's the moment that I tap the opening to attack his legs. to start this work. So we're gonna go there, wrist, neck, we're gonna break. Now, let's say he's going to avoid the takedown with his arms in. So I'm gonna use this momentum to trap his hand with my head and my shoulder. I will shuffle out and take it off his head from my neck right here, holding the wrist. Okay, I use the moment, bump my shoulder, and bring his wrist to my hand. Here, I'm gonna put his arm under my arm. I will let it go of his wrist, turn my hip, with my balance, make his step forward, and I will put my whole bounce here to break his posture. So now I can kick to take me down, or I can start my take down my single leg, go to the back, and start to attack the guillotine. Because if I'm here and I'm broke, I can go for guillotine. Of course, you won't accept, we're gonna start to fight there. So if you do scramble, that's a great, that's a great position to start. So if you want to avoid take downs, first thing, wrist, wrap your wrist, lay away. See, we're gonna do a wrist control all the time. So you're gonna look for my wrist, I will break, I will walk away. I will see, I always worry if it's too close for your leg or not. I always keep a good distance between you guys. So neck, you're gonna move my neck. Okay, go for the deep down. Or, you can do wrist control. Neck down, and go big. I just want you guys to be able to connect the takedown easily. Mm -hmm. You're gonna find more openings doing this way. So wrist, neck, wrist, neck, wrist, neck, walk around. Avoid to cross your feet or keep your feet together. I was on the base, switching legs all the time. Because if we keep one leg on the front all the time, he will notice and he will attack more one side of the body. So if you keep a switch, it's hard for him. So he's gonna try to else to break the ball. Okay? Questions? No? Let's go. Hands up. One, two. Find it out. 